guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Brianna and today I am reviewing the jungle solid conditioner hmm I don't know why I said it like that but it just made me think of um that song you know how it's like you you'll know it if or you might know the name of it it's a jungle out there oh baby it's a jungle out there or something like that if you know what I'm talking about please let me know down below in the comments so this uh, little press conditioner bar has fair trade organic cocoa butter. It has Lang Lang oil, vetiver oil, cypress oil, cedarwood oil, uh, fresh avocado, fresh figs, uh, fresh organic bananas, fresh kumquat, fresh passion fruit and gardenia extract. So it is a very tropical um, type of bar. It is full of goodness smells really good um it's not my favorite scent um like someone suggested to me oh you might have to go and buy the jungle um body spray i don't really want to smell like this on my body personally just my opinion um it's kind of got this um like woodsy earthy note to it which i don't personally like um but once you use this product and use it on your hair it's actually quite mild um and i found that it definitely wasn't very strong which is good now it is good in the sense like if I don't want a heavily scented conditioner in my hair it, it's a good thing so I usually use the candy rain conditioner which is a very very heavily scented product if you guys know what one I'm talking about um, very like sweet and candy-ish and in your face um, but sometimes I want something a little bit more mild and sometimes I'm doing sort of like a, a shampoo slash conditioner um, that's sort of like an in-between wash. And sometimes a heavy conditioner like Candy Rain could be too much um, with all like the nut oils and things like that in it. I definitely see this product as something that would be is more sort of suited for in-between washes. I found it was very moisturizing. I thought it was enough um, for my hair personally. Um, but within about two to three days, I did notice my hair had lost a little bit of luster, which doesn't normally happen with the candy rain conditioner. Just my personal opinion. Uh, but look, I think it's a great product. I, I don't like the amount that actually went missing because this I've only used this once and a lot of the product has already disappeared. Um, I usually, what I try and do is I try and soften the bar a little bit under the stream of the water. So I usually take about 30 seconds just to warm it up. It doesn't actually get rid of any of the product. It just warms it up. And then I sort of lather with my hands and then lather through. And I also tried it just using the bar a little bit on the ends as well, just running the bar through. Uh, look, personally, I think it's going to be a four out of five rating. I am very impressed with this compared to the American Cream Press Conditioner, which I did not love. I think I gave it a three and a half out of five. Um, I liked the scent. I love the American Cream scent, but the press conditioner was not, not my thing. And it sort of turned me off trying this one. And the only reason I tried this one is because a subscriber suggested it. So... Yeah, I, I love your suggestions um, as subscribers. I really do value your feedback. Um, as long as it's respectful, I completely um, am happy to take it. And yeah, I I think it is good for thick hair because my hair is quite thick um, and it does need a lot of moisturization. And I did like it. I thought it did a good job. Um, yeah, just I would like something that doesn't, disappear as quickly and I would like something that had a little bit more of a sweeter scent or a little bit more of a floral scent um, that would be more suited to my personal taste yeah but I still think it deserves a four and a half out of five rating for it so yes thank you very much for watching I do appreciate all the support that I get from you guys if you like these types of videos please stick around for more and yeah until next time take care enjoy the rest of your day or night wherever you are in the world and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.